Okay. Well, um, going to Mullen was obviously a great experience. You know, I, w I was with uh, Coach Logan for four years, won three state championships, and uh, left in 2000, 2011 on top. Um, but when I came to Alamosa, I'm an Adam State guy. And when I say that, I mean you, you learn to love Alamosa, you learn to love the small town, and then you learn to love playing at a small school. Um, it really is an inclusive community, and um, really is an inclusive community, and uh, um, that's what I love about it. And as a person, you know, you go from Denver, you've seen all these people all the time, faces you don't know, but you walk through Alamosa and you get to know great people every day, uh, and you see them every day. So, yeah, um, expectations are high. We just brought in a new O line coach, Tony Case, um, and he's brought in a lot of high expectations. We kind of changed up our O-line schematically. Uh, we had a young offense last year. Um, so expectations are high. Obviously, my expectation is to have the most rushing yards out of anybody in the nation for our offense. That's what I want. I want to be a run dominant team. But um, obviously, we have quarterbacks coming in who can play and can throw the ball. So we're going to throw the ball as well. And that's, I just want to be a dominant offense in the conference. I think you have to be technical. You have to be technical. Um, what you have to do is you have to know the defense better than they know themselves. You got to know their tendencies, and you got to need you, you need that edge. Um, and also, speed helps. Speed helps get around those bigger guys. So um, that's what I try to use. And last year, I was even playing left tackle, and that was uh, that was tough. You get guys who have, you know, arms hanging all the way down to their ankles, and I got these tiny little arms right here trying to block them. So you have to you have to get uh, you have to get uh, technical with things. Get a little uh, creative at times. Exactly. Uh, I think Connor said it best earlier. We're going day by day. We want a championship. That's obviously our goal. Our max championship, national championship. We want a championship, but it's going day by day. Um, we want to beat the big schools, but we also we lost to Fort Lewis last year, and that was a close game. And um, those are games that we need to pull off. We need to pull off every single game, week by week. And if we do that, and we do it effectively, then we can win the championship. Okay. Um, our, I'll start with the offensive line. This is the best offensive line group we've ever had depth-wise. We did a lot of great recruiting this year. The coaches did a lot of great recruiting. We brought in a lot of great guys. Um, and a lot of them have been down here this summer, so we've been meshing really well, and they're learning the offense very well. Um, quarterbacks, we have four quarterbacks right now, all, all trying to get the starting position. So we have depth there, and they're all equally capable of starting for us. Wide receivers, I'm telling you, we have, it's strange that we have so much depth on our offense right now. It really is because it never happens. It, it ha ha hasn't happened in my time here. Um, we have a ton of depth at wide receiver. Um, so a lot of competition going on, which is great for an offense, especially a younger offense with a couple key senior leaders. A lot of great depth, and uh, I'm excited to see what happens this fall camp.